Hey everyone, um, so it's been a bit since I uh, last gave an update. Um, I was a little MIA for about the past five days, I guess. I've been super crazy busy at work, um, and I just honestly, I just haven't had time. Uh, I also just started doing yoga daily, um, and so usually by the time, you know, I've worked out, Got, I've gone to work, worked out, made dinner, and then I do yoga, and then I'm pretty much ready for bed. Um, I just haven't really gotten around to posting. Uh, but I should, because this is day 15 of my um, uh, standard process purification program. So, uh, why don't I give you guys, I'm not going to go over my food, because obviously I don't know what I eat the past five days. Um, but I can give you at least my update on my stats, uh, which I should have done yesterday. So let me see here. Um, okay, so weight loss, um, I have, and this is going to sound so crazy to me, the first week I lost six pounds. And, um, this is technically the second week, I have lost two pounds. So I started at 236, I am now at 228. Um, my body fat percentage has gone down by 0.7%. Uh, my BMI has gone down by 0.3. And uh, I'll tell you my measurements um, so far. So, so far my measurements are, um, my ankle is the same. I lost about a quarter of an inch on my calf. I lost half an inch around my thigh. Um, I lost half an inch on my hip. I lost half an inch on my waist. Uh, I've lost nothing on my bust and my arm and my neck. But overall, um, like I said, I feel really good. Um, my stomach feels really good and not bloated. I did eat something a couple days ago that I found I probably shouldn't be eating. Even though it's okay and it's on the list of okay foods to eat, it didn't sit well in my stomach. So I ended up gaining like two pounds, but then I lost it <laughs> within a couple days. But I think it's just from being bloated and inflamed that I gained the two pounds. Um, and that's cabbage. Uh, I made Ethiopian food uh, last week. And I had made this cabbage, and it's supposed to be cabbage and potato, but I used cabbage and sweet potato dish, and it was good. But yeah, like the next day, my stomach felt kind of bloated and sort of in knots, and so cabbage is definitely out. Um, so I won't be eating that again. I made Ethiopian food again last night, but this time I made darwat, which is uh, uh, chicken, and uh, gomen, which is collard greens, and then um, uh, the Barbera lentil dish that I made last time, and so that was all super good, but anyway, um, and I think that's all I really have for an update. Um, everything's going really well. I rearranged my office today uh, at work, so now I no longer have the sun glaring right at my screen. Um, my workouts have been going very well, and that's kind of it. Uh, I can't believe I only have, oh my gosh, six more days, so I guess I'm done on Sunday. I think it's my 16th day. Yeah, it's my 21st day, so Sunday will be my 21st day. And then I'm supposed to start doing food reintroduction. Um, so the way that my nutritionist wants me to do it is once I get to into food reintroduction, I'll introduce one food that I haven't been eating, like egg, for example, and I will have three servings of that. And then I wait three days to see how my body reacts, and if everything is all good, then I can continue to eat that, um, and then move on to the next food title. I don't know what I'm going to do because I am traveling to Palo Alto for work, so... Uh, I'll have to kind of figure that out. I mean, unfortunately, I'll be eating out almost every, well, not almost, I will be eating out every day. I need to figure out what I can eat. Um, honestly, my first reintroduction food might be corn tortillas, because I might just be eating a lot of tacos. <laughs> um, 
But yeah, we'll see what happens. Uh, I think I might just end up taking, I made some gluten-free uh, granolas a couple days ago and that's pretty phenomenal. So I think I'm gonna make another batch of granolas and take that down to California with me as a snack because I figure even from a hotel standpoint, even though I can't really eat eggs, or I guess I will be able to eat eggs at that point, but um, what I'm thinking is I'll probably just end up eating fruit or something, fruit and veggies for breakfast and then um, eating a salad for lunch and then a granola for a snack and then I'll kind of wing it for dinner and see what happens. But it'll most likely be around the lean protein and steam slash roasted veggie route that probably will end up having to do. Anyway, uh, like I said, that's it for me. I hope you guys all have a good day and I'm excited to see what happens in the next six days. Hopefully I'll lose two more pounds. That'd be great. <laughs> all right.